What's up guys, Shinsuke Garcia here from tech for geeks and I've got another ROM for your Nexus 5. Now this is the long awaited video about the Pac-Man ROM. It's one of the most popular ROMs available on most Android devices and it's based from Android 4.4.2 KitKat. So you're basically going to get all the KitKat features except you get some additional features from Paranoid Android, AOKP and Cyanogen Mod. Now what's really cool about the Pac-Man ROM is the ability to switch the theme from gray to black and I thought that was really cool and neat feature as it really matches the flatter UI of Android 4.4 and it looked really nice as well on this HD display and I'm pretty sure most of you guys are going to appreciate that. You've also got pack palettes which is a powerful feature on this ROM and here you can edit the status bar, the interface, ribbons and navigation bar. Now. With the navigation bar, you can actually rearrange the placing of the buttons. So if you're not happy with how the multitasking button is placed, then you can place it to a different side. Now I'm sure you are all familiar with Moto X's active display, which basically displays your notifications when the phone is unlocked. So you will always know if you have a notification or not. Last month, the same feature was introduced in Paranoid Android. You can also view it the moment you grab the phone, although it is still buggy, but that is expected since it is still in beta. Another cool feature of the ROM is how it displays the RAM usage. When you press the multitasking button, you can disable it, as most of you will probably, you know, not need it anyway, since the 2 gigs of RAM on the Nexus 5 is more than enough for the phone. But I just thought I'd show this to you guys and show you how powerful this monitoring tool is. The last feature I wanted to show is actually a gesture and when you double tap the status bar, it will actually lock the phone and I thought that was really handy and I found myself to be, you know, using it a lot and you won't often see this on any ROMs. I think this is the first ROM to actually have this feature. I may be wrong, so just uh, let me know in the comments uh, below, but you know, for me, this is new. So to me, that was really neat. To be honest, there are so many features in this ROM that I just cannot show you in this quick overview. I mean, there's the quick shortcut toggles as well, and you can also swipe to the left to bring out the search bar, and there's a bunch more. So I do recommend this ROM to you guys to, you know, just try it out because the chances are you'll probably end up making this as your daily ROM. And, you know, in terms of, you know, making this as your daily ROM, it's actually pretty stable. Um, the battery life is really good as well, especially on standby mode. So I definitely um, recommend this to you to try it out and let me know what you think about this. So there you have it. That's the Pac-Man ROM for the Nexus 5. And if you enjoyed this video, then make sure to hit the like button. And if you want to see more videos from us, then make sure to subscribe to the channel. I'm Jens Garcia from Tech for Geeks. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you all in the next one.